The Louvre is a must-see tourist attraction for those visiting Paris, but there's a very unwelcome visitor in the gardens outside of it, rats. Cue horror film music. Experts estimate that in Paris, there are approximately two rats for every Parisian. And in the Tuileries Gardens next to the Louvre, the furry vermin have become so used to humans, they don't even hide. So that's a lot of rats, but how did they all get there? It seems people are pointing their fingers towards tourists as the party responsible for the problem. The Guardian spoke with a local gardener who said the tourists throw their scraps of pizza and sandwiches all over the place. Although the local report rats in public gardens have been an issue in the past, too. For some tourists, the rats are all part of the Parisian experience, thanks to Disney animation Ratatouille. That movie is about a rat in Paris who aspires to become a chef, though he's a lot cuter than a real rat. And there seems to be a slight variation in how this story is being portrayed. American outlets are often using the word infestation in headlines. Rats, they're having problems with a major infestation. But headlines from overseas are a bit more generous. While the word infestation is used in the articles, the headlines say things like rampage and overrun. We would say plague is a bit dramatic. The Louvre says pesticides are used regularly and officials are now bringing in outside help. The story picked up steam after a photographer took pictures of the rats. Thanks for watching. For Newsy, I'm Lauren Zima.